You have some criticism of my handling of this matter, Secretary Rontaine? Not at all. I hoped merely to convey the concern shown by the President when he briefed me for this visit. It would be very helpful to all of us if we knew if you could indicate what action you will now be taking against me. Very well, Councillor Burkle. You may tell the President that I am appointing a space commander to take absolute control of this matter. He will be exclusively concerned to seek, locate, and destroy Blake. Oh, excellent. Excellent. May we know the officer's name? Yes, you may. Space Commander Travis. Project Avalon has failed totally. There will be a full inquiry. Until that time, you are relieved of your command. It takes all my life. I will destroy you, Blake. I will destroy you. I will destroy you. Launch the pursuit ships. Goodbye, Blake. Wait. I have waited. Too long. He's the bonus, Travis. That box, Aurak, that's what we came for. If it does only half of what was promised, it'll give the Federation greater power than it's ever known. What are you going to do? What do you think I'm going to do? I think you're going to kill me, Travis. With or without orders from the Supreme Commander. With orders, Blake. All right, Travis. Go ahead. Ah! Ah! Don't move. Good shot, Avon. I was aiming for his head. You can be like God. A lofty ambition. Thank you. You betrayed me. Blake is a reformed character. There are only two traitors here. You are right, Clone Master Fenn. Travis's behavior was unpardonable. I have ordered him back to my headquarters with instructions to place himself under arrest pending immediate court-martial proceedings. I trust this is in accordance with the rule of life. You understand the rule of life, Sir Valon, almost as thoroughly as you understand trust. disagreeable way to travel. Ah, Callie. How lovely to see you again. Where are the prisoners? Under guard, madam. Bring them here. And you must be Zen. Affirmative. So tell me, Zen, how does one operate this craft? One manipulates the controls and the craft functions accordingly. Yes, Zen, I've heard of your impudence. Now perhaps you will tell me how to manipulate the controls. Welcome back, Supreme Commander. I apologize for not being here in person to greet you, but I think you'll appreciate my reasons. Be careful of Travis. The catharsis he got by killing that first clone will have worn off by now. He's as mad as ever he was. But then, aren't we all? One last thing, Supreme Commander. I must tell you this. You are undoubtedly the sexiest officer I have ever known. Goodbye, Servalan. 